Harpa Grid reduces operation costs by automating repetitive tasks with AI in your browser. In this video we will walk through setting up your first grid automations to scrape data, search the web and run AI-powered workflows. First, navigate to the Chrome Web Store to install the official Harpa AI extension, compatible with Google Chrome, Microsoft Edge, Brave, Opera, and Chromium. Once installed, Harpa can be turned into a grid node to act as a remote worker in your browser. To activate your automation node, launch Harpa on any web page, switch to the Automate tab at the top, then turn on Remote Control function. Once enabled, your node is ready to handle remote automation tasks, search the web, scrape page data, launch predefined and custom AI workflows. You can call your grid node from make.com, Zapier, and API. We will use the handy no-code make.com service to automate your node. Please click the link in Automate tab to install the official Harpa app to your make.com account. Create a new scenario. Pick one of the Harpa grid actions, for example, a run AI command module to run any AI workflow automation on your Harpa node. At this point make.com will ask you to set up a Harpa AI API connection. To control your grid node remotely and securely, you need your unique API key. Click Create New Key button in Harpa Chrome extension. Copy your new key to make.com module connection. Pick a command you would like to run in your browser for make.com scenario and paste the command name into the make.com module name field. You can pre-fill inputs for Harpa AI command if needed. Pick a URL to open in your browser whenever the module is to be run. You can leave it empty to use the default blank page. Pick a command parameter name that stores the AI command execution result, in this example it would be JSON. You can find parameter names in the command editor within Harpa. You can omit the output parameter for make.com to use the last chat message as the result. You can set an ID of the node which should run the command. Harpa Grid supports running the same command over multiple browsers. Omit this setting to run your command on the first browser node. Click Run button in Make to test the scenario. You should get the, the command results displayed in make.com once the command runs in your browser, in our case, a JSON file containing domain data. Harpa Grid integration for make.com provides the web search module to parse web search results, retrieving links, titles, and descriptions. Click plus in make.com to add the Harpa search the web module to your scenario. Select your previously saved connection and enter the search query. This module will return a data array containing the search page text content and up to 8 links to found resources, titles and descriptions. You can use this to build data scraping and data enrichment workflows. You can use a scrape web page module to parse web page content in markdown format. Add the Harpa scrape module to your make.com scenario. Select your connection and enter the URL to parse the web page content. You can also retrieve specific elements from the scrapped page via CSS, XPath, and text content selectors. Please check out our web search and scraping guide for more information on using selectors. Run your make.com scenario to check the result. You will get the complete markdown text of the page, all retrieved locally using your browser, which is secure and allows for web automation behind login forms. Please check our API section to explore all modules in details along with examples of the practical automation scenarios. Contact us at support at harpa.ai for assistance with Harpa Grid setup, integration, or to discuss your business needs.